Hi everyone, welcome to this tutorial on building a voice-enabled alarm clock using the Pico Voice platform. In this tutorial, we'll be using the Pico Voice SDK, Pico Voice Console, and Tkinter GUI framework to create a context-aware voice assistant in Python. So let's get started. If you haven't already, download Python from the official website and sign up for the Pico Voice Console and grab your access key. In this tutorial, you will also need to go to the Pico Voice GitHub repository. Under Rhino, grab the alarm context file, and under Porcupine, grab the Pico Voice wakeboard file. All of these are free to use. Next, we need to install Pico Voice, so open up your terminal and run the following pip command. We're going to need a few imports further along, so we'll import them now. We will define the paths to the files we just downloaded and add a timer parser class to handle the timer functionality. This will manage setting, resetting, pausing, and resuming the timer, as well as updating the display every second. We'll create a cross-platform GUI using tkinter. This involves creating a window, adding a label to show the remaining time, and launching the window. Next, we'll create an instance of Pico Voice by providing the paths to the Porcupine WakeWord and Rhino context file, along with the callbacks for the WakeWord detection and inference completion. We will also need to read audio from the microphone, so install PV Recorder, read the audio, initialize the recorder with the appropriate frame length, and let's start it. Finally, we'll ensure that the application closes properly by stopping and deleting the recorder Pico Voice instance when the window is closed. Then we'll start the audio processing and run the main tkinter loop. Run the code and let's try it out. Pico Voice, set the timer to 2 minutes. Pico Voice, set the timer to 5 minutes. Pico Voice, pause the timer. Pico Voice, resume. If you're interested in building more complex voice assistants, don't forget to visit Pico Voice AI and check out our other offerings.